Hey, this is the Resurrected Hobbyist, bringing you another speed painting video. This time, it's a page from the manga, Gundam Wing, Glory of the Losers. When I start work on a coloring project, the first thing I do is collect the needed reference images so I can be sure I'm using consistent colors. In this case, I needed Wing Gundam Verkai, Duo Maxwell, and some scenes of fire and destruction from Gundam Wing. I also needed to get some references for the locations of colors for the back of the Wing Gundam. For the Wing Gundam and Duo, I just grabbed the colored images from prior pages and dragged them over into the working file. For whatever reason, I started with the blue colors. I don't know why, normally I would start with the most used color in the element. In this case, it would have been the white. But, for whatever reason, the sections that would be blue drew my attention, so I started with them. I like to work in organized layers, with each major element in a folder, and each color shade of that element on its own layer. Most of the time I use between three and four shades per color. A basic, typically darker color, followed by two midtones, and finally a highlight. The manga, Gundam Wing Glory of the Losers, is a retelling of the original Gundam Wing series that incorporates much of the side stories and background that was developed after the original anime series aired. On this page we have two panels. One is the upper three quarters of the page while the second is inset in the lower quarter. The upper panel is the real glory of this page as it contains a wonderful shot of the Gundam Wing Verkai, seen from the back, standing amidst a destroyed Oz base. If your primary knowledge of Gundam Wing comes from the anime itself, then you may not recognize the Wing Gundam on this page. When Wing Gundam, Endless Waltz, was in development, noted mecha designer Hajime Katoke was tasked with redesigning the Gundams and ultimately devised what we saw in the movie. He later redesigned the original mecha from the series itself. His redesigns of the Gundam Wing mecha gained considerable popularity and Gundam Wing Glory of the Losers uses his designs over the original anime designs. Wing Gundam was one of the more substantial redesigns. Interestingly, this has led to some minor debate about the canosity of the original designs. Some people maintain that with Glory of the Losers being a direct retelling of Gundam Wing, that makes the original anime designs no longer canon. Others suggest that all the designs are valid. Still others are like, dudes, we get more Gundams, who cares? Personally, I actually prefer the redesign of the Wing Gundam over the original anime version. For the burning buildings, I grabbed a couple frames from the opening of the anime. There is a shot of the heavy arm standing amidst a burning refinery or factory of some sort. This page is from the period of the story based on the content in the fifth episode of the Gundam Wing anime, Relina's Secret. In the manga itself, this page is from chapter 12, A Banquet for Pallades. In it, Duo Maxwell, pilot of the Death Scythe, and Hiro Yui, pilot of the Wing Gundam, both go to take out the same target, an Oz base. And being the closest to a normal person out of all the Gundam pilots in the series, Duo just can't resist getting into a bit of a pissing contest with Hiro. And such contests tend to involve a lot of shouting.
So, in our final composition of the page, we have the Wing Gundam standing amidst the carnage it's just unleashed on the base in panel one, with Duo screaming his condemnation of Hero in panel two. And there we have it. The finished colorization of a page from Gundam Wing Glory of the Losers. If you like this video and want to show it, be sure to click that subscribe button down there. You can also follow me on Facebook and Twitter. If you want to donate to help out, you can do so through Patreon. If you're a line artist and would like to have your work featured in a future video, drop me a line on Facebook so we can talk about it. Thanks for watching, everyone.